How much calcium do we need in a day? Some experts think that the current recommendations of 1,000 milligrams a day for most adults and 1,200 for women over 50 are too high. And one of the people who thinks those recommendations are too high is Dr. Walter Willett. He is the chair of the nutrition department at Harvard, and he thinks that we would do well on about half that amount of calcium. Willett says that the recommendations were based on somewhat limited studies that show that even with calcium and vitamin D, there was only a small effect. And that was only slightly likely to decrease the risk of a hip fracture. The concern is that too much calcium from a supplement in particular, is likely to increase the risk of a kidney stone because that excess calcium has to be filtered out in the urine. Secondly, too much calcium can slightly stiffen the arteries, which could raise blood pressure and increase the risk of heart disease. We don't want that. So what do you do? Well, Dr. Willett is recommending around 500 to 700 milligrams of calcium a day. And by the way, that recommendation is consistent with the UK and with the World Health Organization. Now, uh, with those recommendations, it's not that hard to get it from your diet without a supplement. You don't need a supplement. Uh, if, especially if you consume dairy products, milk, uh, kefir, yogurt, around 300 milligrams a cup and a cheese. If you don't tolerate dairy, you can uh, switch to a plant-based milk. Most soy milk, uh, almond milk, are fortified with uh, calcium, around 300 milligrams, so just make sure that if you're using plant-based milk, that's the, the case. Um, beans, you know I am the bean queen. One cup of white beans is 120 milligrams for a cup, and uh, a quarter cup of almonds, like to get your nuts daily, around 80 milligrams. They're a little higher than some of the other nuts. And greens, you wanna get three cups of greens a day for a lot of reasons, but three cups of arugula, spinach, kale is around 150. Tofu, a half of a cup, depending on how firm it is, around 150 to 200. So listen, here's what you do. Tally up how much calcium you're getting in a day, and if there's a shortfall, supplement with a low dose calcium supplement. And keep in mind, your body can only absorb about 500 milligrams at a time. So, so listen, it's just not that difficult to get calcium from the food you eat if you pay attention to good sources of calcium and eat a wide variety of foods. That is smart eating.